You're beautiful, you gotta wake up And beauty do apply to if you wanna wear the makeup Be proud of what you is, put your lipstick on Go up in your glam bag, fix your face if you want it. You don't succeed, try again, apply it to the skin If you know what I know, then you would dive right into the glamour of the makeup So what it's gonna take us, for you to gonna wake up And that's to fix your face up I'm back! Welcome back to my channel, The Struggle Is Real With Put Jamie, the makeup nurse Today is First Impressions Friday and Fro Flower Beauty. And it's also Positive Thinking Day, Celiac Disease Awareness Day, Uncle Sam Day, Blame Someone Else Day, Peanut Day, Kids Take Over the Kitchen Day, and Bald is Beautiful Day. If you want to join the Pajami Club, hit that subscribe button. Sit back, get comfy, and let's get started. And we're going to start with the Flower Supernova Celestial Skin Elixir from Flower Beauty. And this week, I have been not doing very well with my skincare or makeup. I have not filmed all week. Actually, about a week and a half. I haven't filmed, really. In the last two weeks, I filmed one day. All right. We are going to use this palette from Too Faced, the Aptly in Love palette. And this is the palette. Look at how beautiful it is. And I didn't get dressed yet because I didn't know what I wanted to um, do yet. So let's go in with, hmm, Caramel Apple. I actually smell it. A lot of the Too Faced palettes lately is very, it's like, you're like, I think I smell it. And I, you know. But the ones in the tin seem to have better quality. With the scent and the formula. So, I would. I had to break down and get this. I saw, um, like I don't go on the websites anymore because I know I'll, I'll want to buy them. But I watched um, Chris, Chris's makeup and uh, more do it, use it on her channel, and it's like I had to do it. Okay, let's go in with this candy apple. Guess I'm gonna do. Of course, this shade. As long as I put my shirt on before foundation, I'm good. So I don't want to get my shirt full of foundation. Yeah, this shade looks so pretty, the sparkling cider shade. So I'm gonna go in with it, my finger real quick first. Oh my goodness, that's so pretty. The cinnamon and the peach one was one of my favorites. I think. This one is going up on my list. I can smell it so good. 
it's all on the pan it's got a mirror look at how beautiful so far the shades are doing Okay, let's go in with now Aptly in Love because we gotta try this shade. Hmm. So far, I am really loving this palette. I'm so glad I got this. Okay, now we're going to use the What's Up Beauty Positiv Positivity Lightweight Hydrating Face Primer. <clears throat> So for celiac disease awareness, it is an autoimmune disease that's genetic, um, but it's where the ingestion of gluten leads to damage in the small intestine, and that's why a lot of people will have, like, um, if they eat gluten, they'll have a lot of stomach issues. All right, we're gonna try this Pacifica All Light Multi Mineral BB Cream All in One. And when I um, looked at this, it said it was sent. It looked like it was scented, so I hope so. Cause that's why I bought it. No. Hmm. I put way too much shade 11. It's not scented. I can smell. Today, anyway. <sighs> I'm disappointed of that. Let's see, let's see how it performs. It is a BB cream, so it's not going to have full coverage. Yeah, it's like very light coverage, but it's a BB cream, so you got to expect that. Okay, we're going to use the Flower Beauty Concealer. This works pretty good with the for coverage, so I'm going to put a little bit more. Sure, my face gets covered. Yeah, people. At, uh, I've only had one person at work make comments, but like the hotel person, it's like, "Oh, you don't have your makeup on." And I'm like, "Yeah, this week's been a struggle. The struggle has been real this week." I don't know, I've been waking up with a headache. I don't know if it's the way I've been sleeping. I just haven't been feeling the greatest. 
All right, now we're going to use this iconic London palette. <clears throat> okay, let's go in with this medium bronze and lightly do it just because this actually matches my face well. It like almost doesn't look like I have foundation on. So I just want to go really light. That blends in so good. Wow. Okay, let's do the rose blush shade. And then maybe next week we'll try that shade. Oh, wow, this is really light. And now the highlight shade, which is highlight. You're so original. But anyway, back to celiac. Um, it's one out of a hundred people are affected, but only thirty percent are properly diagnosed. So there could probably be more people affected with it. I know some people are like, even if they're not diagnosed with celiac. They have issues, like, I've had issues, but they actually, um, did run the celiac test, and I did not have celiac. So, but I have a lot of Crohn's in my family, and, um, I just haven't had, which is an autoimmune disease, too. Autoimmune, it goes is big in my family, like runs big on both sides of my mommy and dad's side. So I'm doomed. Okay, now we're gonna use the Miracle Glow Satin Finishing Powder. Yeah, highlight shade. I don't know. It was really light, but so was the blush. I have to use the other shade the other shade next week and see. But um, when people eat silly, uh, wheat or grain or gluten, um, it sends out a, an a immune response to attack it, the small intestine, and that's why, and that's what happens with the autoimmune diseases. It's like they think it's a foreign body, and so they send out the response to attack it. All right. All right, let's do our T-zone. Okay, now we're going to use this Essence Sun Club Matte Bronzing Powder. <clears throat> it was supposed to smell. I think it does. Um, and then this is in 01 Natural. There's my, there's my brush. But when the 
they send out this like attacks or whatever to the body it attacks the villi which are small like finger like um projections in the small intestine and when that's damaged that's what actually leads to nutrition absorption that's you know promotes it so nutrients can't be properly absorbed into the body when this happens so that's why celiac is so important that you don't have your eat your gluten you can really damage your small intestine let's contour our nose See how light this is really light too, which is good, especially for today, because I've everything's so light that I've been using so far. So why that didn't really be darker. I don't think I really need this one today, but I think it blended pretty good. All right, now we're going to use the Benefit um, Blush and Peach In. And it was supposed to smell like peaches, but then, like, I don't know, I think <sighs> Ken said he didn't smell it. So we'll see. I think I do smell it. I think it smells like peaches. I would think it would. And this is light too. Which is okay. I don't believe I have a highlighter. So we're going to use this broken one from Flower Beauty. It's the Pyramids one. Okay, let's go in with snow. So, so snackable. A little bit different from the candy apple shade. And let's blend that out with the Flower Beauty brush. All right, let's see what we can get out of this Lash Warrior Mascara from Flower Beauty. getting much out but it's not clumping like it was last week and there that's better all right 
let's go in with crunch time. It's going between that and orchard or apple in my eye. Oh no, sorry, smitten. Smitten is this middle shade. Or apple in my eye. Well, let's do both. Let's do apple in my eye for up here. That way we get try more shades of this palette. And then crunch time for the inner corner. Okay, let's just kind of blend. Okay, <clears throat> and then we're gonna use a flower scribble stick. And remember, if you don't treat celiac, it can lead to cancers, and other autoimmune disease, like you're more at risk. If you have one autoimmune disease, you're more at risk of get more. And the other ones are like MS, multiple sclerosis. And it also puts you at risk of heart disease and cancers of the small bowel. So make sure you're, if you have celiac, you're getting that treated and getting, you know, your, um, diagnosis and stuff or like preventative maintenance okay now we're going to use this flower drew berry more in the shade berry more lipstick because i don't think i have a lipstick all right Now we're going to use the Flower Seal the Deal Setting Spray, Hydrating Setting Spray. Ooh. And we are done, but let's review and we're going to, this um, went on pretty, it's very light, especially for a hot summer day, but I was upset that it didn't it wasn't scented and this primer worked wonderful no patchiness or anything that I can see this palette I love it smells it's beautiful it's got the shades on it so I don't have to like sit there and try to guess and it's got a mirror and it's actually scented where you can smell it um, then we have the iconic London palette um, which I already got my fingerprints all over it. The um, rose blush and the highlight was really, really light, which is fine. Um, I used the medium bronze, so, or, um, so that worked out perfect. And then this Essence one was very light. It actually s smells, but it's very, very light scented. And so is this peach one. I wish they were more scented like this because I can barely tell and I'm like I think I smell it and I like to be able to be like I know I'm smelling uh, smelling it but that is it I think for all my first impressions for I liked everything so far so um, next week I'll try some of the other shades and um, yeah I was just more disappointed that this didn't smell um, otherwise I, I have enough BB creams I wouldn't have bought it but anyway this is it for first impressions Friday and flower beauty let me know what you think down below and the riddle of the day is does an apple a day really keep the doctor away comment down below and I'll see you next time bye